Hi, my name's Lucy. I'm from Melbourne, Australia, and I'm working on a game called Dragons in Space colon Space Dragons. <laughs> what I'm working on in the game is creating tile maps, and I'd like to know how you make more complex environments in a game. Using tile maps is a common technique in video game development. The core scene in Psychonauts 2 is a great example of tileable maps. You're in this very large, beautiful space, and you get a sense that there's a big world that you're about to explore. But if you have a really large scene, that loading time is going to be longer and longer, and then that's just not a great experience when you're waiting. There are images for sand, grass, and dirt. There are only three images, but they're repeated everywhere. So reusing assets repeatedly saves us this space. And so because they're seamless, you don't notice them repeating. You use tile maps so that you can focus on the unique assets that you need to make, not the elements that are not as important. My advice for anyone who's starting to make games is to learn everything. You don't have to know what you want to do because there's so many roles that you can have in game development. You could be an artist, you could be a musician, you could be a programmer, you could be a producer who tells everyone what to do. There, there is a space for you, so I would say be curious and learn as much as you can and know that you will grow along the way. <laughs>